Yo, 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 what's going on guys, your boy is Pilot 2K7 and we are coming in with our first ever farming simulator video. Now I know you guys are probably wondering, what the heck is Ace Pilot doing in farming simulator? Well, turns out they have some really cool mods from farming simulator and I'm going to show you guys some of the cool mods I have downloaded so far and uh, if you guys are interested definitely check it out very it's a very cool game it is on sale as part of the steam sale this week as well if you pick it up so if you guys want to check it out definitely do so and i'll also link all of the mods in the video description down below so shout out to all the mods that made all of these awesome vehicles here so let's take a look at a couple of them we have a dot truck here department of transportation and we're going to go ahead and hook that up to a plow down there got a blizzard plow uh, we got a, what is this, a Silverado, looks like 3500 Dually, that could be hooked up to a Palo, uh, the Boss Plow, we got a, another Silverado here, this one is really cool, also a Dually, cool thing about this one, it has a, what is it, what do you call it, a gooseneck trailer attachment, so that's for towing like a gooseneck, plus you got your regular uh, tow hitch there as well. And these two are pretty cool too, because these have the salt spreader attachments on them. Um, what else we got here? Oh, New York plates on everything, too. Cool. Alright, so we have another plow here. This one is a Western plow. And this is like a roll, roll back here. I gotta find the, um, the, the other part for it. Um, but I'll show you guys that. Uh, we have a trailer here. We can attach trailers. Another plow. Another plow. Another plow. Another plow. And... <laughs> Plow attachment. So Farming Simulator is a really cool game. You can do so much stuff in it. I've been watching um, other people's videos and I've just been amazed at how much stuff you could do. So let's go ahead and try out some of these mods. I'm thinking which plow I want to put on each vehicle here. Um, let's take this plow here. Let's put the boss plow on this Chevy Silverado. So let's enter it. So Chevrolet Silverado 3500 plow truck. Oh, wrong button. So I'm still learning the game, but um, so far I am enjoying it. So let's start the engine. Alright guys, so I got the, the sound turned down a little bit. So this has a boss salt spreader on it. So let's put the uh, boss plow on it. Match it up here. So yeah, like I was saying, this game is really cool. You could like have plow trucks, you could have trailers, tow trucks. A lot of things that I try to do in GTA 5, I realize we can actually do in a uh, farming simulator, which is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and attach this. I think we can just actually attach it from the outside. So let's just attach. And as you can see, that easy. We have a plow. So this is something that obviously I have been kind of role playing Grand Theft Auto 5, but obviously I couldn't really do too much for Grand Theft Auto 5. But in farming simulator, I, I could actually do this. And if you look at this too actually move the plow guys like how cool is that so we got our boss plow move it up and down if we put it too low it kind of lifts up the truck kind of cool left to right very very cool there all right let's put that up like that you also got a nice interior view on most of these vehicles as well so that is awesome so let's um let's turn off the engine oops and let's exit so Let's see how it looks. We got the boss sauce spreader and we got the boss plow right there. So that looks pretty cool. So that's one of our vehicles here. Um, let's take a look at, let's try the Silverado here. Maybe we'll use this just to tow another vehicle. So let's start it up. This is the High Country 2017 3500 Chevy Silverado. So yeah, like I was saying, these vehicles are so cool. Like. The mods are so cool. It's so easy to grab a trailer. And like I said, a lot of this stuff I have been trying to do in Grand Theft Auto 5, and we do a decent job at it in Grand Theft Auto 5, but having a platform that's dedicated to this kind of stuff, it's just amazing. So really do want to say the mods have done an amazing job. So see how easy this was? We could just go ahead and attach this so easily. Oops. So yeah, that's looking good there. Let's go ahead and get back in. Let's attach it. So see that easily we just pulled a trailer. Like this is so awesome, man. 
as so like realistic too so yeah i'm definitely gonna be playing a lot of farming simulator guys hopefully you guys will enjoy enjoy it uh, if you guys are looking forward to farming simulator definitely let me know by hitting that like button and um also leaving a comment down below let me know if you guys want to see farming simulator on the channel hopefully you guys do so we have that here um what else we have to do let's see uh, let's turn off our trucks we gotta save gas uh, uh stop engine all right cool so next let's have this needs a plow too so let's see this is a western so let's use a western with this we're trying to match up all of our equipment okay the lights on this work as well that's pretty cool Alright, so this truck is a little bit quieter, so we gotta turn up the volume. Alright, so let's go up front, let's attach it. Alright, so we got our western plow, western salt spreader. I'm actually show you guys some plowing as well, so make sure you guys stay tuned to the end of the video there. Alright, so let's put our plow up. And I like to angle them for fuel efficiency. So yeah, that's another one of our plows there. So we got a boss plow and we got a western plow. If anybody is into plow, I know a lot of you guys have told me before you guys are into this stuff. What kind of equipment do you guys like? Like what type of trucks you like? What type of plow equipment? Yeah, this looks awesome. All right. So this is a rollback. We don't have the right piece for this. I got to look in the shop and probably buy it. But let's um try it out anyway. So I have some strobe lights. Oh, that's really nice there. So I got Stroh's lights. Uh, we could extend the arm. Press in A. Yeah, I wish I had the rollback. I'm going to see if I can find a rollback by looking in the shop. That is really cool. And we can retract the arm as well. It's a very, very cool truck there. Uh, let's turn off the uh, beacon lights. We're probably going to leave this one here. Alright, for some reason the lights doesn't want to go off. Alright, so next vehicle we have... Alright, so now we just have plow. So let's see the steel T truck. Let's see what does it need to um, hook up a plow to it here. Let's jump into this. This also has working strobes. Looks pretty cool. You can also open up the uh, cover, which is cool like that too, to get the salt in there, which is pretty awesome. Alright, start the engine. Alright, so let's see if we have any of the correct attachments over here. So let me know what you guys think so far about all of this. Like I said, I thought this is amazing how much stuff you could do in Farming Simulator, and I really am excited. Oh, reverse lights and backup sound. Very cool. Alright, let's see. Can I attach to this thing? Yes, we can. Alright, so we got that. And now we gotta get our main plow on. Alright, let's try the big looking one. Alright, so we attach that on it. And let's try it out now. Okay, very cool. So this one is like a highway kind of plow department of transportation. Very, very cool. Go up and down. Very, very nice. Now you can also attach a wing plow to this thing as well. Uh, which one of these is the wing plow here? To be honest, I'm not sure how to attach the wing plow. I don't think it's this one here. Whoops, I just hit that other one. Alright, let me try to go around. See if we can go get that one right there. But this is very cool, guys. Very, very cool. Like I said, I'm not sure if I'm doing this properly for the wing plow, but I'm just going to... Oh, yeah, I think we are. Oh, no. That detached it. Oh, 
perfect we got it wow look at that all right so we have our wing plow on now we can control two plows here now I think when we have our wing plow on I think we go it looks like we can only control one at a time I may have the wrong plow in here I'm being honest I may have the wrong plow let's take that one back off but this looks really really cool so we got this cool Department of Sanit <laughs> Department of Transportation truck here. So let's go ahead and do a screenshot of that. And um, yeah, very very cool. So let's go ahead and head into town now. Um, kind of want to show you guys around town and see if we do a little bit of plowing as well. So let's jump in. Let's jump into Chevy first. All right, we gotta start the engine. go. Whoa, this thing is fast. Right, let's line up all of these vehicles here. This looks really amazing. So we take like a really nice screenshot of all of these cars and then we'll go ahead and see if we go pile. So let me know what you guys are excited to see in our farming simulator series. Definitely I'm going to be starting this up very soon. I guess this will be the first official video here, you can see. Let's park this right over here. This is so freaking cool, man. Alright, so I got that. Um, why did I have these clouds here? Man? These clouds over here, that would be good. Oh, uh, let's try to move these clouds over somehow. We need like another truck to come move these clouds. Let's see if we can use this to move it. Oh, this has the steering on that axle too in the middle. Wow, very cool. And these vehicles drive so like realistically too. Alright, I'm not sure if this is gonna work, but I'm gonna try it. I guess it is gonna work. Alright, cool. So I'm just using this truck to move these piles out of the way. Somehow we are stuck, guys. Maybe the plow is too heavy. Try to put it back down. <laughs> the plow is too heavy. That's strange. I know this plow isn't made for this truck, but it should be able to hold it. But it looks like it's not able to. All right, so by putting it all the way down, that kind of helps us lift it up enough to get it going. So let's move that over here. Let's also move these other piles out the way as well. All right, I'll just put it right there. I need like a freaking forklift or something right now. All right, um, I'm gonna move that plow right there. Might as well move this one since we're right next to it. Alright, and let's grab that last one and move that out the way. It's a very cool truck. Looking forward to try out the rollback. So if you guys have any ideas for Farming Simulator, definitely let me know guys. Like I said, I am like really excited to play this game. Alright, so we'll leave these extra plows over here. Uh, go ahead and turn this off. Hop out. Let's jump in our sh uh, Chevy here. And let's just throw this in the back somewhere. But yeah, this is very excited. I like, I am so excited for this series. So let's just throw this in the background right here. Uh, so, alright, so that should be good. Let's turn it off. Alright, so let me know what you guys think of our lineup, and let's see if we go plowing now. It's going to be our first time plowing on the channel, like which is pretty cool. 
Yeah, this looks really cool. Now I gotta see if there's like any like camera options to be able to like take cooler screenshots and stuff, but this should do it for now at least. there um but yeah i gotta see if there is a oops special type of camera setting that we could use dynamic vehicle camera nope yeah i gotta see if, like there's some cool like mode to like, like move around and stuff i don't really know Trying to just press button just to see if anything works. I'm sure there is. I just don't know how to yet. But um, yeah, that looks pretty cool there. So let's go ahead and head into the town real quick, and let's go ahead and tow the vehicle. Um, let's take the. We oh, got GMC and a Chevy. Let's take the Chevy. Actually, no, we're not gonna take this one. Let's turn this off. Turn this off. I'm gonna take um, this one here because this one the beacon lights are working. So we're gonna take the Silverado. I mean the Sierra. All right, so let's head over to the other side of the map now. Should be right over here. There's traffic, which is pretty cool as well. All right, so let's head over, guys. All right, so let's head to the other side of the map. There should be some snow over there. Still learning the map. Uh, I don't remember where I have to turn. I think it's further down. Let's just head down here and see where we end up at. But um, yeah, so far, let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, the steering on some of the trucks is a little sensitive, so I still have to try to probably figure out some better settings. But it is so cool. Like, look at this. We can just lower that just a bit so we can see a little better. Perfect. So I got plenty of space so we're not hitting the ground in no way. I think we got to make, I think it was that left we got to make. So I'm going to go ahead and pull a U-turn. And we'll make the right. And let's see if we can find a road to plow, guys. Now there are a whole bunch of different types of maps which are pretty cool as well. So I'm looking forward to trying out the different types of map maps out there. Downloaded a couple um, that I'm going to try out. Alright, so here's a little lot right over here. So we can try to plow this house over here or this area over here. So let's go ahead and try. And uh, yeah, let's try to plow that truck out right there. So we could say like this is one of our customers here. Let's go ahead and lower our plow and angle it to the left. Uh, let's get nice and low here. And whoops. Oh, we're on the grass. Oops. Oh no, we're on we're kinda on the ground too. Alright, I'm gonna lower it a little more. Now this snow is really high as you can see, so it's gonna take a lot to plow out of here. The Sierra is handling it though. I'm gonna see if I could turn the sound up just a tad here. Alrighty. Oh, look at that four wheel drive action right there. This is so cool. Alright. So we are in some serious high snow, guys, but nothing that this GMC Sierra cannot handle. So we're gonna go ahead and back up. Oh, I may have spoke too soon, guys. Oh, we are in some trouble, guys. Oh, uh, we are in some trouble. Alright, let me see if I could... Alright, we're using a plow blade to kind of get out of that jam there. Woo! The snow was way higher than that. Oh, we're slipping and sliding right now, too. Alright, let's try to go all the way back here. Oh, this is hard. Alright, let's start over. Let's get this plow really low. Let's start clearing up the area so we can at least have some traction. That's a little better there. Let's back it up a bit. Yeah, let's have another go at it. Get it nice and low. See, this is the stuff I wish I could do in my another day at work series at um, Grand Theft Auto Five. So maybe we have to like combine that series into Farming Simulator and Grand Theft Auto Five or something like that. All right, I don't want to get stuck in too much snow. 
So we're gonna just keep on backing up. Now this is a multiplayer game as well, so you can also have some friends and do this on a server, which is pretty cool as well. I think we need a bigger truck here, guys. The snow is just really, really heavy here. Uh, I'm going to continue, though. Let's hit our plow this way. Put it down all the way. And see if we can plow this way over here. There we go. So yeah, we're gonna need like some more equipment to take out some of the snow here because this is kind of serious how, how heavy the snow is. But this is really cool, this plow though. I'm really am enjoying this, like I said. And I hope you guys did enjoy. This was my first farming simulator video ever on the channel. So I really hope you guys do enjoy. And I thank you guys for all the support as we attempt to hit 160,000 subscribers before New Year's. Wow. 2017 has been an amazing year, and I do thank you guys for it, and I really do hope you guys enjoy the video, and uh, like I said, let me know if you guys are excited for Farming Simulator, so that's going to do it for this video, um, let me know what other vehicles you guys would like to see me use first, I'm going to try to keep on plowing this um, yard here, so I'm going to be a little bit busy. But hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you leave a comment down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.